What have we got, Beige? It's not exactly new, but it's back in stock. Is this Totoro? No, this is Saletta. Saletta. Is it the ball or the girl that you get? You're both. <gasps> You're both. People can't see while I'm hogging the box. Is that... So she, she's one of the main characters out of... <laughs> I was going to say, is she, Mercury, is she a witch from Mercury? Yes. And I'm pretty sure she piles the aerial, which everyone wants. And I was going to grab one, but they're all gone. That, that suit. Okay. You know, we, we just got in the latest aerial, which is the aerial rebuild. So it must have gotten smashed up and they rebuilt it. That's generally what rebuild means. Is it? Mm. So these figures are really good. What's the ball got to do with it? I don't know, it's one of those balls. It's a what? It's a horror ball. A horror ball? Yeah. This thing? Yeah. What does horror ball do? I don't know. I think it's like an R2-D2. You seem to know a lot. It has ears. Maybe it's like a mobile phone. Oh, I don't know. Maybe the, the Witch of Mercury. So we've got different face plates as well, or inserts, and they're all being pre-painted. She looks surprised there. Oh. She looks surprised. What about the next one? She probably lost her horror ball. What about that one? Oh, did she come in a stand? Come to a stand. So you can make her stand up. Yep. That's handy. You make her do flying kicks and all that sort of business. She looks angry then. Looks like she's dropped the ice cream. Uh, no? Uh, ice cream? Microphone? She might be singing. Maybe. Okay, so these are different faces. Oh, she's... Three different expressions. Oh, different eyes. Yep. So they can change the direction the eyes are looking. Hmm. Not really sure. amazing joints. Quick release shoes, which is handy. Yep. <laughs> the ball's only got one face. The ball only has one face, yes. There you go. You can do some custom work in. And then they're showing off for the different multicolored sprue there, which Bandai's famous for. Aren't they ever? That's right. Okay, so Soletta's are back in stock. Soletta. Soletta. Okay. Soletta. Soletta Mercury. That's right. All right, what else we got? We got something different. Right. So it's still Bandai, but ah, Bandai again. It's a bigger scale. So they do have some bigger scale things which are more aimed towards the, the scale models. And this is I've uh, never seen one. What scale is it? This one. It's pretty thick, isn't it? I'm not sure. What is a core fighter? So this actually flies out of one of the suits. A what? Flies out of a suit. I think it flies out of a suit. I might be totally wrong there. But it comes with all the figures as well. So you can actually make a similar sort of diorama that you see from yeah. I love it when you get stuff wrong when you get oh I don't know. Well, maybe maybe I don't know. Do they know? Don't know. What about the people at home? I don't know, they can tell me. Let's have a look inside. There they you have go. to now. Alright, so it does have people. Doesn't look like 35th scale. I can confirm there's people there. Looks like 35th scale, doesn't it? 35th? Yeah. There's the figurines. Look pretty awesome. Science fiction is cool. Okay, so you've got the um, the posing just as per the box art. And then you've got all the sprues here for the actual core fighter. And all you need to do is make a base for it. And you have a diorama. That's cool. I really like that. What do you like most about it? How they've gone on even bigger scale so you get more detail out of this universe. Are you not pushing it though? What do you mean? Uh, are you leaving yourself enough room to get the right weathering done before Model Expo? It's Model Expo got to do it. Mm -hmm. And you're doing it for Model Expo this year? No. It's coming up in a couple of weeks. It is. We haven't talked about it this week. No, we haven't. So if you. Oh, pig tank. Pig tanks come along. I'll put magnets in it. 